y'all favorite Texan hero, Pat. Little Roots behind me. Welcome back. Welcome back, y'all, to another FIFA 20 player review. This time, we have someone very special, man. All-time great, all-time iconic. Not only a legend of Dutch football, huh, that's a legend of football in general. It is none other than the 94 rated icon moments, Marco Van Basten, the swan man. Woo! This car looks absolutely insane, man. Before we get into this, I gotta give a big salute to my boy, JD Gaming, man. Marco Van Basten is one of his all time favorite players. And I know you just reviewed him yourself, JD. But I know you'll enjoy seeing this review too, man. So this one's for you, buddy. Now, Marco Van Basten is one of the greatest of all time, right? There are a lot of folks that say he's the greatest striker of all time, even. That's saying a lot. Now, I'm not here to debate that, but since he is such a legend of football, we have to read the icon profile, right on? Marco Van Basten scored multiple iconic goals during his time at the top of the game, and one of these came during an Eredivisie match against FC Den Bosch and 86. Fellow Dutchman Jan Boters lofted the ball to the back post excellently. From the wide area to set up Van Basten's acrobatic effort. He met the ball in the air with a perfectly executed bicycle kick, which made his way into the top corner via the post to ensure victory for Ajax. Come on, man. This guy's incredible. And as we look at his card on paper, it looks absolutely sensational. Big salute to Electronic Arts. As we know, they didn't release his Prime card. Y'all know the reason why. I'm not going to get into that. But they released his Moments card, and you think they'd be petty, but they weren't. They gave him a great boost. And as we look at some pace card stats, we're talking about 86 pace, 95 shooting, 77 passing, 91 dribbling, 80 physical. He's six foot two. Which y'all know that's a requirement. To be an all-time great Dutch striker, you have to be exactly six foot two. <laughs> All right? Six foot two, Cliver, Van Nistelrooy, meaning mean and work rates, right footer, three-star skills, four-star weak foot. So I'd much rather have it that way than a, a doggone three-star weak foot and four-star skills, right? So I have really no issues there. It's Van Basten. He wasn't doing crazy intricate skill moves, especially, and hardly anyone was back in that day, but he wasn't just that type of attacker, right? Now, as we dive further into the stats, it's absolutely insane. Let's start with the physical, 84 strength, 90 jumping, 83 stam, 88 heading accuracy, but as we know, heading isn't, it isn't important this year. Now, this is what I'm focusing on. 94 agilities is unbelievable. Un freaking believable. Even with the 79 balance, I compare it to Prime Moments on Reese card from last year. He had his balance was in the 70s. I think his on Reese balance was like 72, but his agility was like that 94, something like that. And he felt so good on the ball because the high agility just bridged the gap. From the balance and he felt really good so I'm hoping this car is going to feel around the same because he also has 94 reactions, 94 ball control, 90 dribbling, 91 composure, unbelievable dribbling stats so he should feel pretty responsive I'm thinking. I'm not worried about that balance too much but we're going to address that here again in a minute. Passing, 79 passing, uh, 79 short pass rather. Y'all know I'm not really passing on a start because I'm not really too concerned. I would like that short pass to be up a little bit higher. He's This is a fresh card. We bought him fresh, so he just has a basic Kim style, which takes his pa short pass to 83. I really don't have a problem with that too much. Shooting is obviously what everyone knows him for. 
98 attack position, 98 finishing, 93 shot power, 90 long shots, 96 volleys, 88 pins, and 86 pace overall. So you're looking at a guy that should be absolutely clinical, and that's the reason why you buy cars like Van Basten, like you, Dan Destroy, Sheva, all these guys that are just notorious, and Zagi, notorious goal scorers. You just want to get them in your team and bang freaking goals in, right? Now, as we look at Kim Styles, we could go a few, a few directions with this card. Me, personally, I'm gonna go the most obvious one. Let's get these things going, man. Let's bump up this passing a little bit. Let's bump up his pace. Let's bump up his dribbling some, man. We're gonna put the engine on him, come on. <clears throat> and when we put the engine on him, y'all see how, why I did that, takes his pace overall close to 90. Passing up that short pass, plus five. Whew. Agility sitting at 99, a balance at 89. Oh my gosh, man. Even took this low, long pass to 75. I'm super excited to use this card. Let's get into it, y'all. Icon moments, 94 rated, Marco Van Basten, the swan. Woo! Is he worth the coins? We picked him up for 1.4. He's going around 1.55, 1.6 on PS4. Glad I didn't pick him up earlier because his price has dropped so much since last week, as a lot of the moments cards have. Let's get into it, y'all. Yeah. Oh, Marco! <laughs> oh, little back heel, ran into space. And that's a beautiful finish across the keeper, left footed. Beautiful goal, man, from the Swan. Love that. Oh, what a ball, Marco. <laughs> Great pass right there, man. Right to Eusebio when we get a goal. That's fantastic. Yeah, you see the run? Great ball. <laughs> well done, Van Basten, man. My swan. Look, although he has medium, medium work rates, he makes extremely intelligent runs, and what I'm noticing from him already is that he likes to stay on side, man. I don't know if that's that's the the medium defensive work, work rate kind of counteracting it, but he stays on side a lot of the time. He times his runs really well, man. I love it. Oh, you see how he just moved his body right there? That was clean. Oh my gosh. <laughs> he, hey, that 94 agility. Y'all, he can, man, this dude can wiggle, man. Hey, <laughs> this dude right here can wiggle. I'm telling you right now. He can freaking turn on a dime, man. Agile's a cottontail. Look at him. He's freaking fast. I love it. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Oh, we're in. We're in. <laughs> as cool as you like. As cool as you like. <laughs> Gotta, gotta give it to your biggest, most influential players, man. In that situation, Marco Van Basten, last man. Freaking. Come on, man. Open his body up with his weak foot. Y'all, I'm gonna be honest with y'all. His four-star 
weak foot. His left foot feels like five star, man. I feel so confident shooting on either, either foot with this guy. He's pure, pure natural born goal scorer. Look at that, man. That's just pretty, man. Come on. From my swan. Well done, swan. You're balling out, man. Oh, one more to seal it, to seal it, to put it out of reach. <laughs> oh, the swan with the most elegant swan like <laughs> ball roll you'll ever see. Oh, that's just, come on, man. That's, hey, that's what you need to see from your strikers. The lights didn't get too hot for him, man. He loves the bright lights. He loves the big stage. Two goals in crunch time. We needed that. Oh, hold on. Oh, my gosh. Woo! <laughs> 90th minute! We needed him the most. He was there! Right in the middle! With the game winning header, man! This card is clutch, man. He's got that clutch gene. <laughs> 91 composure feels like freaking 99. He's a big game striker, man. I'm loving the heck out of this card because he does so much of the right things. We just needed a goal there. And Baston was there. Like, his work rates. <clears throat> and I, I kind of experienced something similar with Storchkov, Prime Storchkov. Medium, medium, it's not as bad as you think, man, because with the extremely high attack positioning, they cover ground quick. Even if he isn't the fastest striker, like on paper, like Van Basten, and they tend to really ride that last band. They don't, it seems to me, in my opinion, that they don't get caught offside so much as a high low striker. Oh. <laughs> the ball roll. Great finish from Bastion, man. This guy is so, so composed in front of goal. Doesn't panic. That's, I mean, come on. That's just so appealing to the eye. I just love ball rolling the keeper, man. Whenever I get a chance to, I'm going to go for it. Great goal. Yeah, I'm thoroughly impressed with this Marco Van Basten. I really am. He's fantastic. I was super interested to see how he was going to be in game with obviously his really nicely boosted stats, especially that 94 agility. And he turns fast, so freaking awesome. Obviously, with his reactions and ball control and stuff, that helps too. But he feels very responsive on the ball. Doesn't feel clunky or anything, man. He, he he's fluid. Obviously, he's got that that height, you know, that six two height. But turning and everything, like he 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 moves fast. He can really wiggle. So great, huge, huge, massive plus there. And to be honest, as far as cons, there's not really too much I can say about this card, man, as far as cons. I will say the Ag, I'll put that as a con. Probably the only one. The Aggression, you can definitely feel at times where his Aggression was lacking some. <clears throat> but you also felt times with 84 Strength where you could feel that. So I definitely will say that the Aggression is, is a con. Other than that... With the Kemp style, using the engine Kemp style, man, honestly, passing felt fine to me, so I'm not going to really put that as a con. 
I, you know, I was talking about the dribbling just now. Phenomenal shooting, clinical. Left foot, right foot, doesn't matter. And as far as his pace, he 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 didn't feel slow to me. Now, obviously, not the quickest. He didn't feel like you know um, team of the year CR seven as far as pace. But he he's quick though. He definitely is quick. This is a fantastic striker. I think he can slide in a lot of y'all's teams. Obviously, you need to utilize him to his strengths. If you're uh, you like to play with small, short attackers, I mean, this isn't your guy, right? But if you're like to play one twos, link up play with strikers, one thousand percent, I suggest y'all try this card. If you want to wait another week or something to see if his price will go down some more, then right on. But even for what he's going right now, you. You get your money worth, your, your money worth, man, because he can just finish. He makes amazing runs, which is a major pro on this card. It's crazy, like, I love, absolutely love his run making. I love his positioning, the 98 attack positioning, really with the medium, medium work race. He was just always where I needed him. And this dude, I'm telling you, he was just... Right, right in line with that that last man, he he just wasn't just barreling forward, just a barrel forward. He really tried to. I, I really felt like he was holding his position there. I'm not sure if I was on, offside, maybe more more than one time using this card to review. So that's a major plus as well for me. Yeah, I didn't have any issues with work rates, and I had him all come back on defense. So if you hey, you keep this dude on stay forward or something, he might work out even better for you, but I, I, I love having him where I had him, man. Like I said, I'm going to give him, I speak him, speaking very really highly of him, I got to give him a very high rating, because for me, the aggression is the only, only con to this card. I'm going to get this 94 rated Marco Van Basten, the swan, man. I'm going to give him a 9.7. Love this card. Absolutely love this card. A lot of pleasure. Very humble. It's an honor to be able to use cards like this. The composure, so, so, just, he's a killer in front of goal. He is. He was just finishing everything, one-on-ones, ball rolling the keeper, and all that good stuff. So, like I said, I give a 9.7. Love this car, man. Love this swan. A Dutch striker. Got to be 6'2 to be considered a legend, right? <laughs> it seems like it, man, with all the greats that they've had over the years. It's your favorite Texan here. Big salutes. Again, I apologize for my voice. Still under the weather, y'all, but I wanted to get some content out for y'all, and I sure as heck enjoy this one. So big salute to JD and everybody else that suggested me to review this card. I'll talk to y'all real soon, man. God bless.